uh, today we will do one more simple activity to measure the electric potential and to understand about equipotential surfaces so the apparatus needed is a battery eliminated to give the supply then we have connecting wires uh, here we have kept a magnet so that uh, this crocodile clip will remain steady so basically we have applied potential difference between uh, the ring this is a aluminium ring circular al aluminium ring we have poured some water ring is placed inside this glass tube now we have also taken a voltmeter to measure the potential difference at various places now we will start with our experiment now we have applied voltage now see what is and we have drawn some concentric circles with the red eye 1.3 cm 2.3 cm and third is 3.9 cm let us find what is the electric potential on the first circle on the periphery of the first circle if you find it is it is near about 5.5 but if you go away from it you, it is reducing so 5.5 volt we are getting on an average nevertheless on the first circle on the second circle as we are approaching we are able to see the voltage is reducing potential is reducing it is on an average it is coming near about 3 i am rotating the next electrode of the multimeter but it's coming or remaining nearby nearby 3 2.95 or 3 now let us approach towards the third circle now here also we are able to find the voltage has reduced potential has become on an average 1.6 to 1.7 nevertheless if you are on the circle the voltage is or potential is remaining constant so this circular surfaces are equipotential surface see the potential is reducing one more result we can have by this uh, electric potential is inversely proportional to the r if you do some mathematics we'll find the relation